Welcome to JSA TV, where we're covering the latest news, trends, and innovations from thought leaders within the digital infrastructure industry. I'm Dean Perrine, EVP at JSA, and we are coming at you live from beautiful Honolulu, Hawaii at PTC 2025. And I am here with some really, really cool people. To my right, I have I have Deborah Freitas. She is the CEO of Light Source Communications and Pete MP. Pete is the CSO and president of Light Source Communications. Deborah and Pete, welcome to JSA TV. Thanks for having us. Yeah, it's great to be here. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you so much. And um, I'm gonna just gonna jump right in here yeah. with some of these questions. Um, You've had a good, you had a good 2024. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about what good looked like in 2024 for Light Source Communications? Well, Dean, we had a great 2024. <laughs> Better than good. That's great. Right. That's right. <laughs> um, so we were able to launch a couple of really great networks, um, our builds in Phoenix and in Tulsa, which is super excited about those. We hired on some um, key executives and Dan Enright is our COO. Mm -hmm. um, Joe Patton is our CRO. I love Joe, by the way. Oh, he's a great guy. <laughs> we did too. That's yeah. why we got him. And um, we just hired a, a veterans uh, telecom CFO, Matt Gutierrez. So Wonderful. rounding out our executive team has been really great. We rebranded LightSource with a new logo, thanks to our JSA group and um, new website. So it was a great year. A lot of things happened for LightSource and we're really excited about it. Excited about 25 as well. Well, good, because that's what we're going to talk about next. Yeah. Uh, 2024 is in the rear view. 2025 is here. It's mm -hmm. right now. PTC is a great kickoff for 2025. It's the best um, place to be. It, it truly it truly is from, from us Midwesterns. Midwesterners. <laughs> yeah, for sure. Absolutely. But um, why don't we talk a little bit about some of the projects that you have uh, cooking for 2025. Pete? Sure. Well, we are in the middle of uh, our builds in Phoenix, and we have uh, doubled the capacity uh, as far as our assets that we're putting in the ground there, mm -hmm. and we have almost tripled the size uh, mileage-wise. Mm -hmm. So we're very excited. We have between 15 and 20 crews on the ground daily, and uh, the project is, is coming along great. And Tulsa is... Um, I'll let Deborah say a little bit something yeah. about Tulsa, but we're very happy with what's happening there as well. Very good. Yeah, I like to brag about Tulsa for sure. Let's do it. Um, <laughs> Now's your chance. Go right. for it. Dan's yeah. doing a great job leading yeah. all of our builds, but um, Tulsa, um, we had commitments of, of the end of the year, 12, uh, 35, 31 of 25 to be completed, and we're going to be done in March. So Congratulations. nine months ahead of schedule. and. Everything there is is going great. We've expanded. We're adding some laterals there as well. So that project is really exciting for us, and it's uh, we're really proud of it. Outstanding. I yeah. love it. Um, let's talk a little bit about some of the the more buzzy key thing things sure. we're going to be talking about. Uh, where we you can't escape having a JSA TV interview without talking a little bit about AI. Yep. And that's what I would like to talk about next, specifically to the enterprise. Um, I know that you have you have uh, a play there, AI to the enterprise. Why don't you tell our viewers a little bit about that? Sure. Sure. Um, so on the enterprise side, really on the AI side, mm -hmm. Light Source is extremely excited about being actually in front of the edge, the leading edge there. With our dark fiber networks, it's not only what the enterprises are seeking, but they really need to have that mm -hmm. because it helps deliver the high power compute mm -hmm. that really is the engine behind artificial sure. intelligence. Mm -hmm. and, so, and as we go by, um, we are looking at passing as many enterprises as we can. And you'll see, if you look at our networks, it's really with that in mind. Mm -hmm. it, it looks on the on the surface like we're servicing the hyperscalers, which we are, of course. But our real, uh, you know, heart is for the enterprise customers. I love it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And, you know, it, it's interesting. You, you said like kind of uh, 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 in, in front of in front of the edge. I, I do feel like it was specifically with AI uh, application development and implementation. If you're not in front, you're behind. Yeah. Uh, and and it and and the, you know the mystery of AI and all of these things that um, that uh, that scare us maybe about AI. These are also the things that really are going to empower the, the those applications and really are going to be the evolutionary kind of push um, for for enterprises for the foreseeable future. Absolutely. I can't I can't imagine a scenario over the next decade or more where AI isn't 
um, isn't that catalyst that is pushing the enterprise forward. Absolutely. I mean, we remember when, no offense, but we remember <laughs> when the internet became that, right? And no, that, that, We are at that watershed moment we're at right that now. Watershed yeah. moment. So, you know, my kids are in college. They're using AI all yeah. the time. Yeah. I mean, it's just, it's, it's just you know, everything. It's, you know, we can change the temperature on our thermostat from Honolulu, right? Because <laughs> yeah, right. of things like Which that. Which I did just yesterday, yeah. right? So, um, you know, I mean, it, it's just quite amazing. Yeah. And, and I agree with you. There's a little bit of apprehension when you think about For sure. AI, but so many wonderful applications as well. Yeah. And to be ahead of it, to be on the dark fiber side of it is, you know, exactly where we want to be. And we're, you know, we're excited about it. Outstanding. Um, Deborah, Pete? Thank you so much for being on JSA TV. We really appreciate it. Thanks, Dean. Thank you. You bet. And thank you, viewers, for watching JSA TV. We'll see you soon. Make sure that you stay curious, stay healthy, and happy networking at PTC 2025.